Okay, so for some reason your uh, CTO fee charge, your airline ticket charge are not in DTS and you want to place them in there, but you want to do it the right way instead of throwing them under non-mileage expenses. I'll try and show you how to do that. What I'm going to show you how to do, you could do on an order or a voucher. So um, let's get to it. I'll go to official travel, authorization orders. And I'll just pick one of these, click edit. Okay, so uh, I'm in the preview page. I'm going to click travel and then other transportation. Next to type, I'll open up the drop down menu. I'm going to start with the CTO fee, the, the fee you pay your ticket office to make your reservations. And I'm going to go to individual bill. Do not select central bill. Okay, let's go with individual bill. The description's the same, that's fine. Ticket number, I see attached ticket one, and that's fine. Uh, ticket value, since this is the fee, usually it's somewhere around 1364, at least these days. The departure date's fine, uh, ticket date's fine. Anyway, I'll click save. And there we go, it took. It's also over here now. DTS is kind of quirky, so I'm going to do something that might seem a little weird. I'm going to click over on summary and then back to other transportation. Uh, and then I'll go back to type with the drop down menu. Now I want to put my ticket amount in there. So I'll go to Com Air uh, or Commercial Air, Individual Bill. Again, the description's the same. That ticket number has to change or it won't let you save this. So my CTO fee was ticket number one. Let's make this ticket number two as far as the ticket value goes. Uh, hey, let's say 350. And again, I'm fine with the departure date and the ticket date. I'll scroll down to save. There it is. It's also over here. There's a CTO fee. If I want to feel extra good about it, I can go to the preview page, which is the third option from the bottom on the drop down on the lower right. I'll click continue. I will scroll down on the preview page. And there they are. There's 350 for my airline ticket and the 1364 for my CTO fee. And oh, by the way, under commercial carrier, there's 363.64, which is the CTO fee and the, uh, the airline ticket combined. So anyway, hope that helps you out.